Afghan President Hamid Karzai has cut short his trip to Europe after two attacks targeting Afghanistan's Shiite population. At least 55 people were killed at a shrine in Kabul during Ashura, the most important commemoration in the Shiite Muslim calendar. And another four people died in a separate attack in the northern city of mazhar sharif the Taliban has condemned the killings. Let's uh, bring in from Ottawa in Canada, Jalal Rabbani. He's a political consultant on Afghan affairs and was also, is also the son of the late Barhanuddin Rabbani, who was Afghan president between 1998 and 2001. Thank you very much for your time here on Al Jazeera. So these sectarian attacks that we've now seen in Afghanistan, they're reminiscent of uh, attacks in Iraq as well as Pakistan, not really uh, something you're used to in Afghanistan. What do you make of them, first of all? Thank you for having me. Uh, unfortunately, this is not true, madam. Uh, the uh, sectarian violence in Afghanistan has uh, continued since uh, the late 90s and uh, all the way to, to the, uh, 2001. Uh, let's remember the, uh, the butchery uh, uh, killings of the innocent Hazaras, about 15,000 ethnic Hazaras in mazar -e sharif by the Taliban, and the killing of the uh, Iranian uh, personnel, diplomatic personnel at the consulate in mazar -e sharif was also uh, 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 directed in 19. Uh, uh, 97, I believe. Uh, the problems have been there, and unfortunately, uh, groups within the Taliban, if not Taliban themselves, the Kuwait Shura, but uh, uh, associates of the Taliban and, and uh, the web that they belong to, which is ultimately leading to one uh, uh, place, uh, they are responsible for it, and it is a planned attack against uh, uh, the minority Hazaras and Shias in Afghanistan. Uh, unfortunately, these uh, kind of attacks are increasing, and they will be on the uh, increase from now on because uh, the other means of violence Why have are uh, proved. Uh, is not very effective. Now, or, well, unfortunately, they have not just been targeted. They have been targeted for a very long time. Uh, you know, uh, Hazaras, my brothers, Hazaras uh, uh, are Shias, and, and, and when we see they've been victims of uh, all sorts of violence, uh, including physical and, and psychological, uh, throughout the last 30 years. Okay, the Taliban is saying that it, it is not behind this attack, it's condemned the killings. Who do you think carried it out? Uh, well, they are uh, groups affiliated to the Taliban. Uh, the Taliban composed of many terrorist groups. Uh, there's uh, uh, the Hizb Islami Afghanistan. Uh, they're considered a terrorist group. They they affiliate with them. Uh, there's the Haqqanis. There is the uh, uh, Talib uh, Pakistani Taliban on both sides of the border. Waziristan on the Afghani side of the border and also Pakistani side of the border. Uh, there's a lot of uh, regional uh, 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 governments that have a lot of interest in that particular uh, region, and it is uh, very hard at this uh, current stage. To to exactly uh, pinpoint which group affiliated to which organization is responsible to it. It, uh, it needs a few other days to be studied to be uh, exact on uh, assessment. And what do you make of the timing of uh, this attack in Afghanistan coming just a day after this international conference was being held in Bonn in Germany where the Afghan president was there trying to shore up uh, support for Afghanistan? Well, this is a clear sign also uh, to, for the, uh, uh, the participants of the Bonn conference that without the participation of Pakistan and also the Taliban, uh, these kind of negotiations uh, will not mean anything. And, and also the fact that the, the realities of Afghanistan are not seen by them. There's a lot of uh, people that are uh, opposed to the current regime that uh, are not actual sympathizers of the Taliban, but because of the uh, fact that they oppose the government, have uh, end up joining the Taliban. Or, and have been exploited by uh, the uh, Pakistani uh, government. Uh, there's all sorts of groups that are uh, uh, not very happy with the way uh, Bonn was preceded in 2001 and, and again uh, the anniversary at the 10th year. All right, uh, Jalal Rabbani from Ottawa, thank you very much for joining us on Al Jazeera.